Hello viewers, 4DIYers here with another video for everyone. In this video here, I'll be reviewing this portable ultrasonic cleaner from Sterile Pure. While they do market this for your sink, I will be testing this out on engine part cleaning instead. They list it on their website as being a portable multifunctional ultrasonic dishwasher. This has a 37,000 hertz rating with an active oxygen cleaner, is able to provide 360 degrees of resonance, and can be used in a variety of things such as washing dishes, cleaning vegetables, cleaning jewelry, and removing rust. Opening the box, here's the ultrasonic cleaner. It's quite large and heavy, has a thick rubber gasket at the bottom to go in your sink drain, along with a strainer cup, and also has a hanging hook that flips out. The thick cable goes to a controller box, it has a touch screen. This also comes with an adapter plug to use a North American style plug and a cord. For this example, I'll be using it in a bucket of water. Ensure it is sufficiently covered. They recommend doing this in order to have good cleaning action and prevent excessive noise. Pressing the button on the screen, the screen will illuminate. Unfortunately, they don't really have any supplied instructions, however, it does seem fairly straightforward to use. Pressing on the left icon enables the ultrasonic cleaning action. It has three different modes, and each of those are just a timed setting. It can do a maximum of 12 minutes. On the other side is a bubble agitator. It appears that it cannot use both of these modes together. The bubble agitator just provides aeration in the water. I tested this out on tin foil to see if it does actually work, and in the 12 minute interval, it did deteriorate that tin foil. Now for the carburetor test. This is a carburetor off my snowblower, and it's been sitting outside for a few years. It does have some buildup on the inside, but isn't overly dirty. The water here is just hot water from the faucet, along with some dish soap. I try to keep the carburetor centered with the ultrasonic cleaner. It's important that any object does not touch the ultrasonic cleaner. Therefore, I hung it in place with wire. As a close-up here, you can see some of the clouding coming off the carburetor. I ran this for about three 12-minute intervals, so a total of 36 minutes. I have noticed that with ultrasonic cleaners, if you do have sticking or seized components, it does loosen them up. The throttle butterfly was sticking here, and now it's freed up. If anyone remembers a while back, I did the intake cleaning on my BMW M57 engine with the hot water in a garbage can. I used the aeration method with the air compressor. However, I think this would have been an excellent option for cleaning the internals of the intake. Unfortunately, I don't have any other dirty engine components at the moment. However, I will be testing this out in the future and releasing more content to see how it's holding up. Have you purchased this product in the past? Please be sure to share your experiences in the comments below. New videos released every week on my channel. Be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It's a huge help to me. If you're not a subscriber, be sure to also hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching.